Run, Sunny, run. Come on, Sunny. You can do it. Goal, yay! Four people. Only four people in the entire stadium were cheering and celebrating the winning goal. And those four people were our very good, very good friends. And that's what friends do. They encourage you and help you in achieving your goal. But they were as unclear as me when the entire stadium was silent. Actually, everything was going fine. My goal was superb. The only small problem was I scored the goal in my own goal. <laughs> Shift happens, right? Everybody has seen this kind of things happening. Everybody needs a companion. Because as per the famous Elton song, her ek friend saruri hota hai. Every friend is important. Let me describe one of my childhood stories with all of you. There was one very strict teacher in our school. And nobody used to like her. One day, we went to the staff room and placed an artificial snake onto her table and waited outside for her to enter. As soon as she entered the room, there was a loud scream. We were not expecting such an extreme reaction. So we went inside to inquire and what we saw took a breath away. There was a real snake sitting on her table and was looking very stable. We were shocked. In the blink of an eye, we were confronting the principal. Who did that? The question comes. My friends, very good friends, they were so nice that they took a step back. And I was standing in front. I was perplexed. The situation was worse. Principal was fierce. My eyes had tears. <laughs> I was suspended from school for 10 minutes. As we move on from our school life to college life, we see our number of friends increasing in our contact list. Everybody sees numbers growing and growing with the days pass. Let me describe friendship glory in the story. Everybody might have seen Sri Krishna. In one of the episode, Sudama, Krishna's hometown friend, comes to visit Krishna at his palace. Hearing this, Krishna gets very excited and he runs barefoot to greet Sudama. As soon as he meets him, he hugs him and gets him inside his palace. He washes his feet with his own hands. Poor Sudama, he was very, he was feeling very charmed and he was very confused. He has brought some pova for Krishna, but he was very embarrassed to reveal it. But Lord Krishna, he snatched it anyway. Because of two reasons. First, it was his favorite delicacy. Second, it is his palace. He can do whatever he wants. <laughs> so Dhamma returned to his home. And when he reached there, he was shocked to see that his heart has converted into a big palace. And he has got a new wife. Close observation, observation revealed that it was the same wife in new attire. Well, I guess people were not lucky that time. <laughs> Learnings from the story. Do not lose your friends. You never know who is going to shower his wealth onto you. And there is a famous quote also. A friend in need is a friend in need. How many of you recall Tom and Jerry? These awesome cartoony creatures, they make us laugh and they have made an everlasting impressions in our memories with their amazing 
cartoonic stories on the screen. Everybody starts into love, burst into laughter when Jerry hammers the other master. Small Jerry easily maneuvers his way out of all the problems. They get along very well. They fight very uh, along very well. In the end, they bond very well. Lessons from the story. Friends are integral part of life. We may not, we may not love all of them. We may not live with all of them, but we can't live without them. What happens when we move on to our work life? We lose our friends. Why does it happen? Let me describe. Distance widens. Communication lessens. Your friends increases. Friends decreases, and your family size decreases. In our daily hustle and bustle, we forget to cherish this place. But we must, because. Friendship is the biggest test. Over to you.